Hi Aries, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your week ahead. Aries, let's see what you can expect now. Oh my God, Aries, every, almost every other week you guys are getting the tower. There's some huge changes happening in your life, maybe on a uh, long-term basis. It's, it doesn't have to be confined to a week. I mean, this is going to be a month or months of sudden changes coming into your life. I mean, I have the tower again, Aries. I think I had it last time as well, if I'm not mistaken. So things are really changing in a very big way. I have the world card bottom of my deck as well. So some chapters are ending, new ones are beginning. This is like a, almost like a overall of your uh, energy. It's a decluttering or a cleaning up before something new can begin. So what this tower is bringing in this week, I don't know. Let's start the reading and figure it out. Uh, and a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Monday to Sunday, Spirit, what can Aries expect and what's all this tower energy and rebirth energy happening in Aries' life? It's like Rome wasn't built in a day. So, well, the towers are happening so that rebuilding can begin. Uh, it doesn't have to be a one-day process, right? So that's what I think these changes are. Oh, my God, Ace of Wands. Yes, new beginnings are definitely on the horizon. Tuesday, Spirit, Ten of Wands, Three of Swords. Page of Wands, Five of Swords, Two of uh, Wands and the Chariot. Absolutely, Ace of Swords, bottom of my deck. This is definitely a clearing away. I mean, Ace of Swords is a card of saying I'm cutting away the past so that my future and my path ahead is absolutely clear and open for me. So let's start. Let's start with... Uh, Let's start with an affirmation, Aries. Let's see what you should be affirming to yourself because I know, I know, I know it's going to end. The week is going to end well. On Sunday, you do have the chariot. So there is going to be fast forward movement happening after this uh, change or changes that are coming into your life. Now, what those are all about, we're going to clarify. But uh, let's take an affirmation from the universe and find out what you should affirm to yourself so you can sail through these changes. And the card that I have here for you is purpose. I'm strong and determined. The angels remind you that every situation or person is placed in your path with a purpose. It may be to strengthen you, offer you an opportunity to resolve or forgive the past, release old patterns or for enjoyment. Your life purpose is ultimately to do with what brings you joy, satisfaction and fulfillment. Seeking these soul qualities will place you on the path of your destiny. Once on your life path, allow nothing and no one to deflect you from your mission. Your guidance is to ask your angel to help you find the purpose of your current situation or if you are ready, your life mission. Align your strength and willpower and hold your intention to fulfill your purpose. The angels will support you and you will succeed. Aries, once again, your affirmation is, I'm strong and determined. All right, so here it is. And now let's start with this deck. All right. Um, Monday to Sunday spirit. What's the uh, Ace of Wands for Monday? Starts off really good. Ace of Wands. Yep, Ace of Wands, clarified by the Ace of Wands. So the starting of the week looks very, very positive. There's some very, very good passionate action you're excited on monday you're you know looking forward to the future you know, they may be starting a new project or something mm, some yeah so whatever has been keeping you bound and chained for a very long time aries i think you're starting to see the freedom from from that i mean look at this this person has um tied by chains and has a blindfold on and suddenly with this ace of wands energy that you'll be feeling on monday double ace of wands right you suddenly start to feel yes i can finally fly i can fly free it's almost like a caged bird where the door has been opened and the bird is now flying and saying yes yes i'm excited now to fly into the open skies i've been stuck for too long so monday yes seems to be a day of uh, good 
feeling good, feeling balanced, feeling excited, maybe feeling emotionally very happy, maybe getting a nice new offer after a period of feeling maybe abandoned or left out in the cold and you know maybe there was some stuck energy around you but maybe you will start to see get, there, there will be excitement there will be excitement on Monday where maybe your money is looking good or you're feeling stable again after a period of uh, maybe not getting uh, movement or not seeing progression or something so Tuesday spirit what's the ten of wands Oh, here's the tower again. Here's the tower again. Okay. What, what is the tower bringing, Spirit? That's what you wanted to know. What's the tower? Okay. Somebody who may... There was a heartbreaking situation, Aries, in the past. Maybe there was silence from some place or there was a heartbreak. That is going to get resolved. There is some kind of a peace offering coming your way. I don't know whether the uh, angels are bringing you this peace or maybe a friend or a business partner or something. There's, a, there's almost like a, a feeling of after a lot of disruption and silence and secrets or quiet time and heartbreak, here comes in that uh, balancing act. Somebody could be offering you a peace offering. It's like, hey, Aries, come on, you know, and you, you will start to feel, yes, things are finally, like, you know, this is justice, things are coming into balance and it's going to be replaced by a very stable energy where you will feel, yes, I'm now feeling good, I'm feeling stable, I'm feeling, um, you know, secure. I don't know what this is. This could be monetary, it could be emotional. I have no clue. But just when you were on the brink of giving up, it's like, yeah, you had packed your bags and said, you know, this is done, this is over. Uh, no, there is some, some offer coming towards you. This is something that is unexpected. When, when this newness comes into your life, it's going to flip the energy into feeling the complete opposite. So Wednesday spirit, three of swords. What's the three of swords? Yeah, you're moving away from heartbreak. Yeah, you're moving away from heartbreak. It's almost like, like I said, it's going to be a flip energy. It's going to be a, a renewal from heartbreak to suddenly seeing things moving in a positive direction, feeling you've got almost uh, like a rebirth. And on Thursday, I do see you excited about starting maybe a brand new chapter of your life or a new journey or making a new friend. Or it's just like, I'm just excited to start start on this path now. Page of Wands, Page of Wands, Page of Wands. Yeah, something that was restricted in the past, Aries. Something that was restricted in the past or there was a stuck energy, like I said earlier. Maybe you were feeling like, you know, this is all I'll get and uh, this is what where I have to be. So, suddenly it's replaced by the Nine of Cups. That suddenly, like I said, again, the analogy of that bird being caged in a uh, bird being in a cage right and the door opens and suddenly it's all guns blazing so there is going to be something which is going to make something very crystal clear the path is going to be cleaned this week it seems five of swords on for friday spirit five of swords five of swords oh this is bringing a lot of balance and a partnership equal give and take uh, there are people who are wanting to collaborate with you on Friday. I mean, look at this. You have enough for yourself already. Maybe you have enough to take care of your bills and other people, your loved ones. You're in a very secure position. And that is, I think, attracting in even more into your life. Two of Wands, Spirit. Yeah, see, this is like after a period of waiting, finally being able to move forward. I mean, each and every card is suggesting the same thing, that whatever was stuck is now open. Whatever was stuck is now open. But just when you thought you were going to give up, something is suddenly going to open up for you. So even on Saturday, I do see that uh, finally you're choosing a new path. If you've been stuck with the two of wands energy, sitting by the window, wondering which direction is my life going to take. I mean, something is pushing you forward and taking you away from being stagnant into a very peaceful and happy space for your life. This could be your financial success. I keep seeing money everywhere. I mean, I saw the Ten of Pentacles and I saw the Queen of Pentacles, now the King of Pentacles. Like I said, there's a deep, deep, deep transformation coming into your life this week. It's almost like the, the 
tower has already happened that's why i kept mentioning i've seen the tower before for you so tower has happened already and you know it's like when everything is on the ground and one feels well everything is lost and then the rebuilding begins it's almost like things are going to be start getting rebuilt in your life so what's the chariot spirit for sunday what's the chariot yep you're overcoming you're overcoming all battles this is like card of victory success moving forward on your chariot feeling very victorious and uh, yes you finally defeated all your naysayers or your enemies or your people who con you know created created these towers for you i think you're going to be the winner i mean this is a card of victory and success and somebody uh, an emperor or the empress sitting on their chariot and moving forward so you will feel as if you've overcome all difficulties by the end of the week yeah after a period of stagnation stagnation to a wish come true okay so that's a nice uh, nice week this is a week of cleaning up areas you could you could actually activate this energy by just maybe cleaning home or cleaning your wardrobe and you know doing little things cleaning acts which can encourage the energy to clean up the larger things in your life like your own energy space maybe your finances or now uh, your relationships or anything that's not been serving you this would be a good week to do the cleaning up act so that that new structure can start to build that's what i have for you till next time then aries love and light take care namaste